here I fix the Earl Mud hierarchy and tests and also rename some stuff. And so here, this is mostly renaming. The only major change I made was when you add a new child to the hierarchy, each element in the hier hierarchy has to be the, the, the object itself and its children. So I made sure to add an empty list for its children. And then all of this is just renaming, I'm pretty sure. Uh, so instead of calling it obj, I call it new parent child. And then instead of calling it child, I call it child zero, which is a hint that it will be updated to be child one. And here we have, if we've done an insert and successfully inserted new parent child somewhere in the child hi in the hierarchy below child zero, then we'll get back uh, a new hierarchy with that added. And then we'll take that new hierarchy and we'll replace child zero, where we found child zero at the head of three children, we'll repla replace it at the head of three children with child one. So it's got this added back into it. And then I've got to replace, take all these CT pals out because they'll wreck things in production. And then, yeah, just still renaming stuff. And then in the tests, I created, for the sake of brevity, a couple um, single letter function variables to hold uh, Earl, Mud, Earl Mud hierarchy new and Earl Mud hierarchy insert. So H will give you a new hierarchy, which is just a tuple with the parent and then a list of children, which will be empty. And then Earl Mud hierarchy insert will take an existing hierarchy and then add a parent-child relationship to it and should get back OK and a new hierarchy, and you return that. That allows me to um, do this very succinctly. So here we have, if you ask for a new hierarchy, you get an object and a list. And really, maybe I shouldn't be testing this because you're not supposed to know what it looks like, but I want to make sure this works. So yeah, I guess I should be testing it. And so here, if we do create a hierarchy and then use that to insert into that hierarchy this parent-child relationship, you should get parent with list of children and inside the first child is a parent and has no children and then we just keep expanding on that theme so we say create a hierarchy and then insert this parent child relationship and then ins ins at insert this parent child relationship you should get r1 r2 r3 as you know parent child grandchild and then we do it again parent child grandchild great grandchild and so what i need to add to this and i think i may have mentioned this in a comment is i need to add some tests to make sure that um, I try and add a parent child that doesn't fit and I get undefined and then I try and add a sibling so it would be like R1, R2, R3 and then R4 and then another one in this same list uh, as a sibling to R4 would be R5 